don't walk and drink at the same time. There's a serious aviation updates going on over that direction, but it's not come over yet. I'll update you when it does. You know, since you just behave yourself right now, I'm telling you, there will be trouble if you just start prancing about me. Oh, another baby oak tree. I'm going to have to repatriate all these baby oak trees. I'm going to have a wander in the field. Get them dug up and put in hedgerows and they survive. Because these guys will just eat them. Uh, where is Stubby Boobs? He was very overdue carving. Another one. There is work to do. Stubbs, are you for real? Oh, come on, give it up. This is getting silly now. Give us the baby. So, me and Roy are just nipping into the village to uh, go and empty somebody's muck heap. Yes, I am very upside down right now. <laughs> Aviation updates. We're the slurry again. Uh, we're down at this end of the shed now instead of that end of the shed. And high's thickened up. It's thickened up, it has. So, uh, what we're doing is we've just uh, got water out of the tank in the yard, you know, where all of the drains drain into and all of the gutters and roofs and stuff. And we're going to put it in here to help you mix it because meh you know actually just gonna put a pipe on open it up bob's your uncle well it's just causing flooding Absolute irony of death for saying they don't want rainwater added to slurry. Guess what you need to add to it to get it to mix? <gasps> Out of a tank in the yard that's fed by, you guessed it, you guessed it, rainwater. Just gonna stick the whisk back in. These videos are getting very heavy. There's lots going on, too much going on for videos, too much going on. I'm gonna have to separate them. I'm gonna have to spread me out over a week. He is here to shear some sheepers. Difference in them. Yeah. 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 Yeah
rings are on the side of it as well. Rings yeah. on both sides. Of it. Yeah. <laughs> has done so much today literally shaved the sheep with peter um all normal jobs and he's literally slurried all of that you can see him starting in that one there up there getting jobs done well i'm not i'm lazing around the house no i'm jo i'm joking i'm not lazy and i am in the house avoiding working but the same thing ah uh, it's raining now girls here she is oh quick everyone under a bush go on leave me Think of yourselves. Think of yourselves. It's really funny. It's got to absolutely hear it down. They'll all go and stand under a tree. Considering a branch broke off that the other night, it's not the safest place, you know. I wouldn't reconsider, really. So we have just done up Roy's dad's house. I'm just going to go back and get this paint ready for the sheep. Um, so last year, year before, um, there was some poor walls up there that didn't belong to us. And anyway, our sheep kept jumping over and ending up in next doors now once in next doors they could literally go up on a fell and we didn't really know what to do and we didn't know the protocol so we got this stamp that says ash on it anyway i'll show it you i'm ash stamp it's kind of cool and um, caused a bit of a stir on tiktok to be fair um, because the paint that i use is red so people thought i was branding the sheep which just was silly, but hey, it made like, you know, half a million views on videos, which was kind of funny. Oh, I just need to, just got back, ram the girls in the handling system, give them their yearly heptavac, and then stamp the top of them with um, ash, with this stuff. Queen, got my legs, I've got no pants on. Did ask what we use. It's actually made for it. All intents and purposes, I think it looks like um, hammerai, red hammerai, but it's obviously not. It's wool safe, as you can see, and it's called sheep branding fluid, even though it isn't actually branding anything, it's just paint. <laughs> red paint, red bucket, there it says ash, you can see it on the floor. Is Heptavac. Um, once open, it's meant to be used literally within like a few hours. Um, we obviously did ours the other day. And then this is what's left. It's over 10 hours, I won't lie. Hey, no chasing chickens, stop it. Winnie Hoof. Well, it's naughty. It's over 10 hours, I won't lie, but I'm still using it. I don't know if it'll make a difference or whether it depletes or something in that time. I've no idea, um, but the sheep weren't here. Got my twisty sidekick. Where have you? He's there. Roy's gonna come up that middle shut the gate and then wind's gonna send them all the way around ram them in the race Stand. Good i'm all in here because it's just a little bit um
we um, picked these up, space, they were ramming in here and yet yeah, there's just empty wagon now because all them fleeces have gone. Ready, hop, 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 hop. It's that one. Oh, baby girls. Can you believe they were babies last year? Ten. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we brought them home. Honestly, they were ramming because of the size of the fleeces. You could fit another 10 on now. So me and Ray are going for a little jaunt up Stain Moor to drop them back off. Mains. I rammed in to be fair, it has stopped them all falling over and stuff when they were in transit. Go on a date day, date day up Stain Moor. No, I'm joking. Um, we never had a tractor together, that's kind of cute. Where are you? Oh look, some of the Nick's top stones. I'll tell you what, my bum's not on that passenger seat. It's all right when you're driving, but oh, that is not comfy. Valtra, do better. Then I am, I can do it. Ooh, that took some doing. I've just come to check the water after a brief walk up a hill. At Yorkshire Show to borrow, you know, I've like died of parvo or something because I've been drinking out of water with a dead sheep in. A dead rabbit or something. I have to do that because this rise up um, completely basically this is really crappy kind of substandard land and when you graze it low enough it gives the little tiny flowers and plants chance against all the grasses and stuff flowers they're doing well for flowers very pretty for those of you who do enjoy the effort and time that i put in which is an awful lot of it Thank you very much. I appreciate each and every single one of you. I really do.